Today we're gonna hang out at SeaWorld Orlando. Let's take a closer look. Hi everybody, welcome to the world of Micah. Today we're gonna hang out at SeaWorld. You guys are gonna get to tag along. Let's take a closer look. Now before we get started, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because it's free and it'll keep you updated with my latest video. Now we're eating in Fire Eaters, which houses breakfast with Elmo and friends, but we're not having breakfast, we're having lunch. I got the kids fajitas with pork. Abby got the kids chicken nuggets and Travis got the regular side fajitas. What'd you get? Steak and chicken? chicken yeah. Nice. Travis is here too. Now I'm gonna do something I've always wanted to do here. We're gonna do the Sky Tower. I've always wanted to do this and every time I've come it's been broken or closed for the season or the weather has been affecting it. Now you have to get a ticket to ride. Now it's three dollars a person unless you're a pass holder. Then it's free. How you feeling Travis? You ever done this? Nope. Me either. I'm ready. This will be fun. And here we go. Oh my goodness. We're really moving. Wow. This is kind of crazy. Jeez Louise. Welcome aboard the SeaWorld Sky Tower. We'll get to see the construction for the new ride. There it is over there. It used to be the old pass holder building right there where you're a pass holder. And look, they're running water. You can see the, the water right behind the slide there. I cannot wait to ride that ride. See Disney Springs. Right there. And then there's Epcot. Spaceship Earth. That's what? Jaws down there? Jaws is down there. That's right. Jaws 3. And I think we're at the very top now. Here's Aquatica. We're just about 300 feet up now. And from here you can see for miles and miles. Can there's Orlando, downtown Orlando over there. The lush tropical oasis right across the street from SeaWorld. That's Discovery Cove, where you can snorkel with rays and exotic fish, relax on a beautiful beach, and even swim alongside dolphins. Experience Check that out, you can see the dolphins and the other whales. You see Shamu over there. It's kind of cool seeing roller coasters from this angle. They don't look nearly as tall from up here. We are way up here. Like, way, way up here. Oh, there's the, there's the little flamingo paddle boats. All right, now we're going down. We're going down pretty quick. This thing takes no time going down. All right, we did it. Now it's time to get off. I wonder if you go up these stairs, if you can go to the very top. Sky Tower, that was incredible. I will definitely be doing this again. And I never thought I would ever be able to get to do it because like I said, every time I come, it's usually closed for weather or maintenance or something. But what did you think? It's pretty awesome. You get a really, really good view of yeah. pretty much to downtown Orlando, which is uh, what, 20, 30 miles away from here? Yeah, and it's cool because you can see construction updates in the park too. And this is what the construction I was showing you guys is for, Infinity Falls. This is the vehicle you're gonna ride in and it holds up to eight people in there. It looks pretty awesome. And you're gonna be doing an adventure. I'm excited. This is gonna be cool. And it says world's tallest drop. And we saw the drop from up there on the Sky Tower. This is gonna be awesome. I can't wait. And there's the drop right there. It looks like it's gonna go up those little beams. There's like three or four more beams going up, but that's, that's it. So Shamu's Happy Harbor is going away. This guy, your job is done. You're done, buddy. You can retire. Get Sesame Street is coming and we decided to cool off in here with all the penguins and man it feels amazing in here oh yeah feeling frosty right go from like 90 to 40 in two seconds i know oh yeah they are look at that look at this guy why is he he's like what's up bro come at me bro come at me bro travis says this guy's eyebrows are on fleek <laughs> Are you turning your back on the world, buddy? I'll be real honest with you, I'm only in here to cool off. I mean, these guys are cute and all, but man, it feels amazing in it here. It stinks in here too. It, it, it does stink in here, it smells like fish. All right, we're down here at the bottom of Journey into Atlantis, and when they come around, 
I'm gonna push this button and I'm gonna squirt them right in the face. Unfortunately, no one's on these boats. I don't understand why, because the wait's a 75 minute wait. All right, something must be up because they keep sending boats that do not have people in them. All right, here they go. That thing blasts them in the face. Yeah, it comes right over here. I gotta wait until they're right there. Ready, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> Came over here to see the manatees. Look at this guy. He is massive. And there's a couple little babies over here. That one's huge too. Yeah, he is. And this little fella is chomping down on some lettuce. Let's see if I can get him. Here he comes. <laughs> now right up here is the rehab center and this used to be blocked off for guests. It was only a part of like special VIP tours, but now anybody can just walk up here and see the manatees that were going through rehab. It's all a part of the SeaWorld rescue system. These guys have been brought over here by SeaWorld to be put through rehab, and then once they're well enough, they will be released back into the wild. A lot of stuff happens from like boat accidents and other things, so it's cool that SeaWorld takes care of these guys. And you can see on these guys, they had something happen to them, but they're gonna be taken care of here and then released back into the wild. These are kind of hard to see. These are the yellow stingrays. You guys can find these off the Florida coast, it says. Look at him, you see him down there? There he is. Oh, he's kind of winking at me. And then this area, you can just reach in and pet the stingrays. Look at this guy coming up. Hey, buddy. What do you guys think about my new hat? Does it work? Where's the head? There it is. Pink flamingo. Flamingo hat. I could do this, and I could get these. Rock them. I could rock, rock these flamingos, but I feel like you only have to walk with one foot, like a flamingo stance. They look pretty comfortable. Well, maybe not. Are they not? No, I like this hat. That's gonna do it for today here at SeaWorld. I had a lot of fun. Thanks for watching, everybody. I had a blast today at SeaWorld. I hope you had fun watching. If you would like to support World of Micah, go to worldofmicah.spreadshirt.com. You guys can also keep up to date with me by subscribing to this channel. It's free. I'll see you in the next episode of World of Micah, everybody. Until then, stay weird. Goodbye.